You say Planned Parenthood saves lives. No, Planned Parenthood ends lives. They butcher children to death. And you live in a culture that has taught you that it's okay to do this to children. Stop dehumanizing children in the womb. Stop dehumanizing these, these image bearers of God, your fellow man. Why are you judging me, ma'am? Why are you judging me? Man, this is what you support. How do you say it's disgusting? This is what you support. I would think you'd want to hold the sign yourself. This is what you support doing to children. Different opinions that result in this happening to a child. Sir, How's that good? Sir. Yes, ma'am. Can we grab an interview with you? If you'd like to. Yeah, that'd be awesome. Do you mind stepping down or do you want me to come up there? Um, I'd rather uh, whatever you're comfortable with. I'm comfortable standing here. Okay. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Will you just uh, look at me? Say your name, spell it for me. Nicholas. Nicholas? Yes, ma'am. Will you spell it for me? N I C H O L A S. Can you give me your last name? Healed. H E A L D. H-E-I-L-D? H-E-A-L-D. Okay. So, yeah. talk to me about why you're here today. We're here because we're followers of Jesus Christ. We want to proclaim the good news of, of how to be reconciled to God, how a person can have their sins forgiven, and to show that this culture, specifically the people here, what they support doing to children. That's hence the sign. We're showing them, if you say you're pro-choice, they have a sign, a banner that says, we love abortion. I'm showing them what they love. And I don't understand why they would kick us out or have a problem with us being here showing these signs since we're showing them what they support doing to children. You're saying that the, the, sorry, Brian, you're, the police officer asked you to leave? Asked us to leave because they have a permit for this area and so I'm on, a, I'm on public right away right here. So you're fine where you are? Yeah, police okay. have, been, have seemed okay with it. Okay, thank you so much. Yeah, yes ma'am. The Lord Jesus Christ came to this earth to live a perfect life that you and I could not live. He died upon the cross, a terrible, brutal death. He shed his blood to say, so that you could be saved. But you must repent. You must turn away from all your sins and turn to Jesus Christ. He alone can save you. Confess your sins to God now. Repent. Whatever you've done in your life, no matter how many children you have murdered, whatever your background, God can forgive you. But you must humble yourself. You must come to the cross of Christ. You must turn to Him and seek His forgiveness. And He can forgive you. The blood of Jesus Christ can wash away your sins. The blood of Christ washed away my sins. I used to be a filthy, wicked sinner. And God saved me because of His goodness, because of His kindness and His love. He can save you too.